uh, I'm going to talk to you the subject called how to break curses and turn it to themselves. How to break curses and turn them, turn them to themselves. And how to break the curse and turn it to themselves. You know, you can destroy the curse and return them and turn to themselves because they, they are the cursor. You have you are not the curse. You don't curse anybody, but they have decided to curse them to curse you. So every curses they are issuing against you, they will go back to themselves. They will destroy themselves, not you, not your children, because you have not you don't you have not done them to anything. That is how you break the curses. You command them, even when they bring sickness, when they curse you and cast the sickness to you. What you do, you return that sickness back to the sender in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, thank you. Now, curses, sickness, diseases, it is from the enemy. And somebody has planted it. Now, they want you to suffer. They want to the curse to be in you and your family, your children. And this curse has blessed you. And you, it can, not, it can torment you. It can bring a lot of problems. Somebody who is cast, you can never succeed anything. There was a man, I know, this person. Uh, this person, he has been wandering from press to press to look for a job. He has a master's degree, but he has never got a job. I was asking my daughter, does that person now found a job? He goes to everywhere. He has been traveling even to countries, other countries to look for a job. He gets a job for two to three months is fired or resigned. So the right now the person is like mad person. The person is is not himself. He's, he he was handsome, really good, and all the women were fighting for him. He's very 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 smart person. He, he has everything people have. Now, but because he's cast, he can't get a job. He's not even married. This person. Now I I ask my daughter. Can this person go to God and pray and ask God to help the person? But the person, he doesn't want to go to God. He said, that is what God planned me to have. No, God has not planned you not to have a job or God has not planned you to suffer. Remember, God has good plans for you, plans to prosper you. Not plan, not not evil. God has never been having any evil plans against you. Don't say that that is how God planned. God has never planned something like that. That is a lie from the devil. You you go through some difficulty, some sickness, diseases, or you you are you are you are you are in poverty. You say let it, that is how God that is how God planned it to be. No, it is not God. It is the devil. The report you got from doctor that you have cancer. You have some crippled diseases. You have high blood pressure. You have this. It is not from God. It is from the enemy. Yeah. Any reports, negative reports, that reports is from the enemy. It's not from God. God did not say that the cancer will kill you. No. It is enemy Satan. Now the enemy that placed the cancer on you is the one that I'm going to talk to, and I will command that enemy to get out from you and go back to the sender. And return it and everything they have done to you to return back to themselves. Let them feel it. Because the way they make you suffer, the way you feel, let them themselves feel it and drink it as 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 as, as wine or as we as as water in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, I know the enemy has evil plans against you. So to deal with such a evil plans is to turn them them turn them back to the center. Turn these curses back to themselves. Let's look at the book of Psalms 109, 17 to 20. Psalms 109, 17 to 20. The Bible says, He loved to curse. Let the curses come upon him. He loved curses. He loved curses. There's some evil say some people who love curses there's nothing good they can't bless anybody when they see you with something they will be disturbed they will go they will start cursing you they will start they can't sleep they will chant and chant and curse and curse you put all the sources of evil against you until that thing is be destroyed they, they are ready to to 
sacrifice themselves to see that nothing good happened to you. Because he loved to curse, let the curses come upon him. Because he loved to curse, let the curses come upon him. He did not delight in blessing. May it be far from it. Because he didn't, he didn't delight the blessings. He has never blessed you. May the blessings be far from him. Because he doesn't bless anybody now, any blessings that come to me to, to him, may it be far from him. That is what David is praying. David is praying such a person may the blessings of God be far from him. May not the good no, may nothing good come upon this person because he loved cursing. You know, evil people who love cursing, who love cursing, who does not want you to have anything because he loved that cursing. Let that curse fall upon them. Let the blessings of God be far from them. Let it anything good from heaven be far from them. He clothed himself with the curses as his coat. You know, some people they, they they wear curses. They are full of curses. They can they have bad words. They can't talk nice words. They chant. They curse. They speak. They, they when they look at you, they just call you a name. They call. They have names upon names. They call you any name. Every name they are calling you. Let it turn to themselves. Let it turn to themselves. In the mighty name of Jesus. You know, they clothe themselves, they 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 clothe the, the curses like like clothes, like clothes. Every time any time they see you, they talk, they only have curses. They can't talk good good words. Now may it may it soak it to his own blood. May it soak to his own body like water, like oil on his own blood on 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 in into his bones. That is what the Bible says. It says, may it soak to his blood like water, like oil unto his own bones. You see, all these curses, the person is wearing, the person is putting it, may it be soaked to his own body like water and oil on his bone. You know, this is how you turn themselves. They will turn to themselves because they curse you for nothing. A child who is in the womb, you find somebody's cursing the child. A, a child, a one-day child, a hour child, somebody's cursing the child. Let that child die. Or they will lead you a star. After they think that you are an important person, you have a, a star that you will be leading the world. You will be a, a somebody. They will start chanting. They will gather together and start putting a curse on you. They will, they will destroy you. Now, because they love cursing, let it be, be soaked with the, their own blood. In the mighty name of Jesus. May it be like garment that he, he wraps around him, like a belt that he puts on every day. May this be the reward of, of my accusers from the Lord, those who speak evil against my life, those who speak evil, gossip, speaking evil. Some people, they speak evil, they gossip a lot. They don't speak anything good. They would speak evil, they would speak evil evil against you they feel bitter and you have not done them anything you have you are very innocent but because they, they don't like you and they decided to speak evil against you to chant against you to put spells on you against you to, to gossip and the gang together even have witness false witness to give false witness that you said and you didn't say they are there to look for little little something to accuse you they are monitoring you to check on you and find if there is anything they can use against you. They will use even friends. They will use anybody to get you because they don't like you. Now they, they are so angry about you that that that, that, that they, they you have not you have not even you don't know them. You don't know somebody just get angry for no reason. Yeah, somebody can look at you like this. One time, I was going town town, Toronto. And I was in the, in the waiting for the train. Now, when the when I was standing there waiting for the train, another person also came to wait for the train downtown. They call it the, the downtown Toronto. Now, this person looked at me and they started feeling bad, like like he saw something, a, 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 animals. Now he was clicking, clicking, and clicking. I said, "What?" 
Yeah, he doesn't know me. I don't know. We just met at the, at the station, and the person, because of my background, because of the way I look like, because of my color, now the person just feel bad. One time, I was working in a in a in a in a in a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in England, and then this person said, "I hate black people. I don't want to see these black people. When I see them, I feel like I'm going to die. I hate them. I hate black people." And he said. I feel, I, when I see the black people, I feel like I'm going to die. I, I better die if I will share with anything with my black person. I don't want a black person to touch anything, and I don't like them at all. So he was saying that, and I was, I was there, I'm black, and I was, I listen. Then I tell him, you said that if you share with black or you don't like black, you will die? Yeah. Because you have said that, you know what, you will die. I said like that. He said, yes, I better die. Now the person really got accident and died. That because he confessed. He confessed it. Yeah? He hate you for no reason. I tell you that anything the enemy is planning against you, it will turn to themselves. It will turn to himself. It will turn to themselves. Enemies, wherever they are cursing, what they are planning against you, it will turn to themselves. I want to show you what God says about the enemies, about the evil people. Who like curses? The Bible says in the book of Exodus 23, 22. The book of Exodus 23, 22. The Bible says, If you listen carefully to what he says and do all that I said, I will be an enemy to your enemies and I will oppose those who oppose you. So the Lord himself will become enemy of your enemies. God himself will become enemy of your enemies. When God has become enemy of your enemies, there is no enemy, there is no powers of darkness will come and overpower you. He said, I will oppose those who oppose, oppose you. So God will go and oppose them. God will deal with them. God will fight them. God will torment them. God will come against them and fight them on your behalf. Because you love God, you, you know God is your, your father. You trust on him. So he will fight for you. He will deal with your enemies. He said, I will become your enemy. I will, I will be an enemy to your enemies. I will be an enemy. God will be enemy to your enemies. And he will deal with them. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, I thank you. I'm one, uh, let, uh, let us look at another scripture from the book of Esther. Esther 7, verse 10. From the book of Esther 7 verse 10. Here is a man who planned to kill the children of Israel. He had planned because he had power. He was a leader. He has authority to do that. Now what happened? When Esther had so, Esther was a king. Esther had, had that the, the, this person wants to destroy them. Wants to destroy the Jews. Esther issued a prayer and a fasting. He said, let, if I die, let me die. But my people will not die in any one single person who have swear, who have vowed that is going to kill us. Some people, they are leaders. They can, they can be a president who have authority to do what they want to do. But they cannot control God. Evil people, they cannot control God. God, he will kill them and destroy them. Now, when you look at Esther 7.10, the Bible says, So they hanged Haman on the gallows, which he prepared for Mordecai, and the king's anger subsided. You know, the, this man called Ammon. Ammon prepared a gallow to kill Mordecai. He, he went and make it, he paid money and make it, and he was very happy waiting to hang Ammon, uh, hang, hang Mordecai. And Mordecai, he has not done anything. It's because of jealousy and greedy and envious. Now, because of that, let your enemy, let the anybody who is working against you hang themselves. So, wherever they are planning, they would destroy themselves. You see now, Haman had no idea that the very girl he prepared is going to be used to hang himself. He did, he had, if he had an idea, he could not make that the girl. He could have stopped making the girl and make and make, and 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 be in relationship to to Mordecai, but he didn't know. He didn't know that God himself is a power God. He will return back and destroy you. That's why 
every curse that is issuing against you, it will return back to the sender. Be careful. Don't curse people. Bless them. Because if you bless them, the blessings of God will fall upon you. Now, because wicked people, evil people, they don't bless anybody. In fact, they will hold their blessings. If, if one time I was, I was invited to go to, to, to Denmark, I got my visa. No, no, I got my ticket. I got everything. Now, my pastor was supposed to bless me to go to pray for me. Do you know the pastor refused to pray for me because he was jealous, he was greedy. He said, how did you manage to get the visa, to, to get the, the ticket and the invitation uh, from the embassy and go to Denmark? How? How can you? How can it happen? Embassy sent you to Denmark? Why? I said, because what I'm doing. I thought it, he was joking. It, he was not joking. I went to the office. I went to see him. The bishop never prayed for me. He refused. Is he refused completely said no, he's not going to press me, he's not going to pray for me. So it happened that I went and I and I, I because I, I prayed and I said, God, thank you. I went back, I went and came back with a lot of blessings, with a lot, a lot of blessings. Yeah. When I came back, something happened. And and they said that I'm backslide, they don't trust me, I should keep away from the church. And when I came, everybody was afraid of me. Nobody was saying hi to me. Nobody was coming to me. Now I said, okay, I've not done anything. That is fine. This is a bishop. This is a bishop, a little bishop. He hates me. He, he, he doesn't want anything I do. Now, something happened. His, his, his church was bankruptcy. It was there was no money. They, something happened. They offering everything. There was no money in that church, and they had some bills to pay. Now they didn't know what. It was very crucial. They they didn't know what to do. There was there was a lot of pressure in that church. Now since I had a lot of money, I was blessed, and they saw that I got it, everything. I was doing very well. They sent somebody to come and borrow me money. I said, why do you come to borrow me money? Go to bank. I'm not a bank. But because I wanted to show them that God, that whom I serve is God, I asked them, how much do you want? They told me. I gave them a check without even, oh, even finishing saying. I gave them a check. They went to the bank and withdrew that money to show them that God is able. They cast me. They, they did evil. But everything come to their blessings. And them, instead... They, 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 they were the one who are affected, not me. So, you know, Mordecai, uh, uh, Haman was hanged instead of Mordecai. So the enemy will try to kill you, to destroy you. But God, whom we serve, will return the curses back to the sender, back to themselves. Now look at the Psalms 57 verse 6. First, uh, Psalms 57 verse 6. The Bible says, they have, they have prepared a net for my steps. My soul is, is, bowed, is bowed down. They, they, they dig a, a bit before me. Themselves have fallen unto the midst of it. So they prepare a net. They, they dig a dig for you to enter. But now... They enter themselves. They net they put to cut you. The, the net will cut it themselves instead of you. Because that is what it is. Every curses, every net, anything they are, they are planning to cut you, they will cut it themselves. Don't worry about it. You keep yourself in prayer. Trust in God. Pray and fasting. You will see every curses will go. You will command the curses to return back to the sender. Every trap. Good. Every trap they are making to, 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 to cut you, it will cut themselves. When you trust God, you pray God, you, you believe in God, the curses will go. Oh my God. That is fire haram. I don't know what happened. God will help us. Yes, God is good. I want to thank God that God is able to deliver us. And the God will return every curse back to the sender. God will return every curse back to the sender. God will return every curse back to themselves. He will return curses to themselves. Wherever stand against you, wherever is cursing.
us in planning evil, they will, they will be destroyed. One of my daughter, she got a job. We've been praying. She has gone through a lot of deliverance. She has been vetive. She has been, since, we, since she came to my life, I came to her life, she has been doing very well and everything. Now the enemy has raised up to fight her. I saw it. I told her, you see, the enemy who, who vow, who cast that you will never get a job, they will hear and they will fight. They will try everything to destroy you and, it's, and it makes that, that you lose the job. I, I told her what to do and we did it. Now the, those, this very enemy, they will suffer. The, everything they are doing to her, they will turn back to themselves. Because they, 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 they thought that that is the end of our life. How can somebody with degrees, with a PhD, they don't have a job? Is that, is that normal? They, they, they curse you. They said you will never get a job. Like that man, he has master's degree in marketing. A very, he finished from a very known university. He's a very smart person. But he's now old. He's 50 years. No job. Nothing. He has not got anything. It doesn't work. What is that normal? Let every enemy that has blessed the curse on you and your children, let them be destroyed themselves. Let them destroy themselves and their children, children. Let them destroy themselves. Let every curse turn to themselves and destroy themselves in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Let's look at the book of Proverbs 28, 10. Proverbs 28, 10. The Bible says, He who leads the upright astray in an evil way will himself fall unto his own beat, but the preeminence will be held good. You know, some people, they will give you evil and wrong advice. The Bible says, themselves will fall into his beat. I'm going to talk to you back when I come back. I'm going to, to talk to you about this uh, uh, when I come back, part two of this, I will show you how evil reports, people who are who are speaking, report who advise, even even counselors who advise people wrong, they will suffer. I have seen counselors dying and suffering because they give wrong advices. They will be destroyed and be rendered powerless because of evil they are doing. They you go there because you need the help. They cancel you evil. They cancel you. Uh, they cancel. They give you wrong advice, and this very wrong advice it will return back to themselves. We know people who like that in the Bible who give wrong advice, and they, they, the wrong advice turn themselves and they kill themselves. Nobody will kill you. You will kill yourself because you are evil and wicked. You have to do the right things. Then God will bless you. Hallelujah. Let me pray for you. I pray that. Let all terminator, genetic and ancestral sickness be healed in the name of Jesus. I pray generational sickness, terminal sickness, and all diseases connected with the ancestral, uh, uh, with ancestors, let it be healed in Jesus' name. All the sickness in the, in the bloodline, all poverty in your family line, ancestors, Generational poverty, generational sickness, generational curses blessed on you. Let them be destroyed. Let them catch fire and burn to ashes in Jesus' name. Any curses affecting you from generational curses, any curses affecting you from, from your generation, let them die. Let them be destroyed in Jesus' name. I bind the spirit in all of the stuffs. I bind the spirit in all of the staff members who would try to use evil weapon against you, including lying, gossip, slander, and and op, and opinion and uh, spirit. There are spirits that I'm binding right now that are, 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 are trying to use evil weapon, gossip against you, speaking evil against you, slander uh, in the name of Jesus. I cast them, I bind them, I destroy them in Jesus' name. Every curses that is issuing against you, against your head, against your blood, against your children, let that very curse go back to the sender and destroy the sender in the mighty name of Jesus. Let all financial interest be removed in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray generational uh, uh, financial interest, let them be removed in the mighty name of Jesus. And very curses placed on you to hinder your finances, let them be destroyed. Let them be rendered powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. 
enemies of your finances i cast them i command them to die i destroy them in jesus name let their money be dried up let them go bankruptcy let them lose their building let them lose their cars in the mighty name of jesus they hinder you they are hindering they put a curse of your finances now you are suffering them they are driving big cars they are living in a big house let those cars and the houses be dried up in jesus name let everything they are doing against you to turn themselves in jesus name holy spirit be the senior partner in your business i pray that let the holy spirit be a part be senior partner in your business in your career in your work in your place of work and everywhere you are going let the holy spirit be seen and lead you and guide you in the mighty name of jesus yes lord every good thing presently uh, presently you are you are looking for every good thing presently the enemy is putting their hand there i command that hand to be weathered let the hand to be weathered in the mighty name of jesus hand of the enemy touching your staff because they have seen something good is coming, they will put their hand there. Let their hand be weathered. Let it be destroyed. Let it be rendered powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. My God and my Father, I want to thank you, God. I bless your name, God. I, I pray every rejection. I reject a, a spirit of I reject the spirit of failure and the rejection. I reject the spirit of failure and rejection in your life. Every spirit of rejection and the failure in your life, I reject it. In the mighty name of Jesus, I command them to be destroyed. In the mighty name of Jesus, spirit of failure, reject. I reject you. In the mighty name of Jesus, you will not manifest. Go back to the sender. In the name of Jesus, Father, broke every space, costing and profitable leakage to your company, to your business, to your work. In the name of Jesus, every blockage, any blockage in your life. That you want to do something, brokerage is there to block you, to block your business. Let them be wasted. Let them be bound. Let them be rendered powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, let your company become too hot to handle for the dumb bulls and demonic customers. Let your, your company, let your business, let your job become too hard for demonic demonic people to handle it in Jesus' name. Even demonic customers who come with the evils, let them be destroyed in Jesus' name. I pray that, yes, Lord, let the spiritual magnet, ma, magnet, magnetic power that attracts wealthy and keep wealthy be deposited in your life, in your hand, in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my God, I want to thank you. Lord, Give let God give you power to pursue and overtake the enemy and also to recover all the stolen property that has been st uh, the, the enemy has, has stolen from you in the mighty name of Jesus. Let God give you power to pursue and overtake the enemy and also to recover all your stolen property in the mighty name of Jesus. The stolen property in the hand of the enemy. You recover it in Jesus' name. I pray that, oh God, let your fire destroy every foundation problem in the name of Jesus. Let your fire let the fire of God destroy every foundation of problem in your life. Every foundation of problem. Let the fire of God destroy them. Let the fire of God destroy them. The fire of God destroy, destroy every foundation, every foundation problem. The foundation that you were brought in. Let the fire of God destroy them. Let the fire of God destroy them. Destroy them. Destroy them. In the name of Jesus. Oh yes, Lord, my Father. Let every link label and oppressor be destroyed by the blood of jesus every evil link every evil link labor and and oppressor be destroyed by the power in the blood of jesus every evil pregnancy in your life be aborted every evil pregnancy in your life be aborted in the mighty name of jesus every evil pregnancy be aborted every satanic pregnancy be aborted every wicked power be aborted in the mighty name of jesus every 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 evil dirty hand let 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 every dirty hands be removed from your from your affairs in the mighty name of jesus every evil dirty hands every evil dirty hands you evil dirty hands let it be removed from your life in the mighty name of jesus 
Oh yes, my God. Thank you, Father. Every let every done everything done against you under the devil's anointing be neutralized now in the name of Jesus. Anything done against you under the devil's anointing, let it be anointed, be neutralized and avoided in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Let everything done against you under the devil's anointing be neutralized and narrowed and avoided in the mighty name of Jesus. All evil vessels dispatched to do you harm should be crushed in the name of Jesus. They should be crushed in Jesus' name. I am spraying every satanic bank, releasing property, release your property, release your property, release your property from the hands of the enemy in the mighty name of Jesus. Satanic bank, release, release your money. Let satanic bank release your money in the mighty name of Jesus. Let satanic ATM release your money in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, I, in the name of Jesus, I remove you. I command every power that is uh, uh, putting your name in an evil book and for untimely dead. I remove your name from there. I remove your name from untimely dead, from evil report, from satanic bank, from w wicked people in the mighty name of Jesus. All evil umbrellas preventing heavenly showers from falling upon your life. Be roasted, be roasted, be roasted, be roasted, be roasted, be roasted, be roasted catch fire and burn to ashes. Evil umbrellas preventing heavenly showers from falling upon your life. Be roasted in Jesus' name. Uh, there's the evil umbrellas. When you are praying, they are preventing you. They are covering your blessing. They are covering your prayer. So your prayer goes and come back. Let that umbrella catch fire and be roasted in Jesus' name. Satanic umbrella holding your prayers. Let them catch fire and burn to ashes in Jesus' name. Yes, Lord, my God. I thank you, Father. Let all evil association summon to you for your sake be scattered in the name of Jesus. Let all, all let all evil association is summoned for your sake be scattered in the name of Jesus. Let them be scattered. Let them be scattered. Let them be scattered. Evil summons against you. Let them be scattered. Let them be scattered. Be scattered. Be scattered. Be scattered. Be scattered. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Let every problem connected to Brigham in the mighty name of Jesus. Every problem connected with Brigham. Let it be destroyed. Let it be bound. Let it be rendered powerless in the name of Jesus. I command every satanic enforcement against you. Catch fire. Scatter. Catch fire. Scatter. Catch fire in the, in the name of Jesus. I cancel evil vow that are affecting you negatively in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I cancel any evil vow that are affecting you negatively in Jesus' name. There is some wicked to have found like, uh, like Ammon. He found that, uh, that Mordecai is going to die. So they vowed, they have vowed, enemy that they have vowed that you will never succeed, you will never achieve anything. Let it be scattered. Let it be effect, be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. I destroy the clock and timetable of the enemy against your life, in your life, in your children, in your life, in Jesus' name. Satanic, satanic, satanic clock and, and the timetable. They have clock and timetable. They are looking for the time. They have time. They know certain times this is what is going to happen. They know the time. They have clock and time. Now, when it reaches the such a time, it time, something will happen. Let them be destroyed. Let them be landed powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God, I thank you, Father. Let every evil device against uh, devices device against you be disappointed. Be disappointed. Be disappointed. Be disappointed. Evil devices be disappointed. Be rendered powerless. Be rendered powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. I bind every spirit working against you, against your answers to prayer in Jesus' name. Every spirit working against your answer to prayer. You've been praying, but this enemy are working against your prayer answer. Like Daniel prayed, but the enemy hold his prayer his prayer. Now the enemy who is holding your prayer to answer, let them be destroyed. Let them be destroyed. Let them be destroyed. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. I want to thank God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. I have to stop here. God bless you. God bless you so much. Have a wonderful wonderful time, people of God. Go to our website, ww.overcomers dh ministries dot blogspot dot ca or you can reach me if you need prayers you need me to pray for you you can reach me our number is 905-792-3798 god bless you so much this is your host prophetess dr christine sigi saying bye bye to you bye bye see you tonight 
BM, 9 p.m. And also, I'm going to come back sometimes to finish this topic. I'm not done with this topic. So I'm coming back. It will take like 10 minutes. It won't take long. So God bless you. Have a wonderful time, people of God. See you tonight and anytime with Periscope. God bless you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, my daughter, Evelyn. Thank you, my, my, thank you, Anne. Thank you so much. Thank you, Sophie. Thank you. Thank you very much. I love you so much. And there's nothing I can do about it. Thank you, my dear sister, Grace. I see you. Thank you. Bye, 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 bye. Bye. <laughs> I love you so much. And there's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> bye. That's how much I love you. Bye-bye. Bye, see that.